Hey guys, today I want to talk to you about uh, shipping and especially sea shipping because with the whole corona thing going on, uh, air shipping prices kind of tripled, so it's a problem if you ship things from China. If you don't know who I am, if you're new to this channel, my name is Nils Oler. Uh, I am originally from Germany, but I'm in China now for seven years. And we have a sourcing company here. Last year we sourced around a thousand products, so uh, we also ship them. And uh, I, I feel like I know a little bit about it and I want to share that with you. Um, because I think that a lot of you guys are so afraid of sea shipping. It's like this mysterious thing out there that you can't do, right? Because if you only have a few hundred units, like then it doesn't work to put it in a container. You need to have a whole container and you have all of these misconceptions really, because it's not true. You don't need to have the whole container. And I'm gonna uh, explain you a little bit in this video how the how the sea shipping works, how, it's, how you can actually have it easier done than air shipping and what you really need to pay, pay attention to, okay? So with the sea shipping, you don't need to fill a whole container. Actually, if you fill a whole container, you have more problems with it than filling half container or part of the container. And I'll explain you why. Okay. So let's say you have a few hundred units and you hire a forwarder and the forwarder picks everything up at the factory. They put it in the container, they bring it to the port, they do the customs clearance, they, do, they put it on the boat, they do the whole thing for you. And then when it arrives at your port, wherever you send it, if you send it to the US or to Europe, or wherever you send it really, and then they work with the domestic forwarder with like DHL or FedEx, and then they come and pick it up and then they deliver it to wherever you need it to be delivered to. Now, if you have a full container, usually that's not possible. With a full container, usually you end up being the one having to organize it to being picked up at the port. So actually, if you have a smaller order where you only fill partial container, that's awesome. It's actually, most forwarders look for that. Most forwarders need to fill little spaces in those containers anyway. So it's not that much crazy more expensive. Now, if you hire someone for that, you need to make sure though that you get the right shipping terms. Because a lot of times the suppliers or even the forwarders itself they like, they like to draw you in with these sweet offers. And then once you're there, there comes another bill uh, for, for, the, for the taxes, another bill for the clearance, another bill for the unloading, another bill for the offloading, like all of these little things that come in the end of it. So what you need to watch out for is that you have a DDP quote, meaning that it's basically like a door-to-door -door shipping quote, okay? So that means the, the forwarder, they take care of picking up the product at your factory or your supplier. They put it on a truck, they do the whole thing until it's in your country, and you pay them upfront for everything. So based on the HS code, they already know what's your custom clearance gonna be, how much is it gonna be to, you know, to, to, to get your products in the country, what's, what, are the, what are the taxes, and all of this kind of stuff. They know that, so they charge you this upfront. So all you gotta do, you pay them upfront, they pick up products and they ship them to whatever door you need it to be shipped to. So that's a door-to-door -door shipping service. Uh, and that's something we also do. So if you're interested in um, you know, having us handle your shipping um, here with our company in China or having us to do your whole sourcing process, that's something we can do. So there's a link below where you can just schedule a call with me and then we can you know, speak and see if we're the right fit, if we could help you and really lay out the benefits that you have with that. Um, you don't need to commit to anything, it's just a, just a harmless call. So go ahead, schedule that now, and if you are in need of sourcing or if you're in need in uh, shipping, then that's fine. If you have any other question about that, post it in the comments, and I'll definitely I'll shoot a video about it or answer it in the comments. Uh, so whatever shipping questions you have, whatever sourcing questions you have, let me know. If you have questions about uh, e-commerce and selling products online, we'll have a whole web class for you that is a one and a half hour, all the knowledge that I gathered over the last years crammed into one, uh, one web class that you can watch right now. There's a link below in the description for that as well. I hope this video was helpful. Make sure you subscribe to this channel because here we talk a lot about sourcing, selling and profiting from your product. So make sure you subscribe and you don't miss what's coming up uh, tomorrow because that's when I'll see you next.